Recently, somebody gave me this Mac Pro 2009. The problem with the computer was every time you turn it on, the shine would start and then it kept playing it over and over and over again. couldn't get no video and the computer was never able to boot up first I removed the video card inside of it was a ATI Radeon HD 5770 I removed the card then I turned the computer on when I did the computer the shine only play once so I said to myself, something is wrong with the video card. Because at this time, the shot, it wasn't playing it over and over again. To be sure, I removed, I put the card back in the computer and turned it on again. And this time, the computer started playing the shine over and over again. Okay, now that I'm sure it's the video card, I went on eBay, looked for a card. And the prices were scary. They go from anywhere. The cheapest one that I found was about $125. And, and it's a used one. A new one could go anywhere from $350 if you buy it directly from Apple or even higher. Especially with the one gig. I had nothing to lose but to try to fix my card. Okay, first I remove it from the computer. Then, then dismantle it. Remove all the covers and just bring it down to just the board, clean the board, the GPU, remove all the silicon, or then put it in the oven. 10 minutes prior to putting the board inside the oven, turn the oven on and put it on 400 degrees. We heat the oven for 10 minutes before putting the video card inside of it. Now open the oven, put the, the plate that has the circuit board in it, the video card in it, in the oven, and put your timer on for exactly seven minutes. I use the one on my iPhone. It's very good and it will ring to remind you. Now adjust the temperature of the oven down to 380 degrees and let it go for seven minutes. Seven minutes is up. Now remove your uh, hat board from the oven and let it sit there for about 20 minutes to let it cool off now it's time to reassemble use some silicone put some silicone a compound over the gpu and get ready to reassemble the video card okay the technique that i apply here could be used on any other dead video card or motherboard
closing the box, it is very important to start with the this X in the back of the GPU. Those first four screws are the most important screws when closing the box. And also don't forget to plug the fan cable and the power cord when putting the video card back inside the computer. Very important. As I told you before, it's very important to plug this power cable in the back of the video card. 